morning everyone welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel african moa so today i'm in a different place i wanted to tour around this is a road trip to kasese that is western uganda in western uganda we have a lot of districts so i'm going to one of the districts that is kasese i think i ordered at around at around the 8 p.m because it's uh the, it's a long journey it's around like eight hours to nine hours it's a long journey so the road has been so busy but in the morning i'll be i'll be when i've already reached in uh, around midnight i'll be when i've already reached in uh, we are in Mube. <laughs> No, we are in Mubeh. We are in Mubeh. We are in Mubeh. We are about to go to the gate. We are just stopped for some drinks. Some drinks is that are drinks. Go and touch. Go and touch. Ah, we are in Mubeh. We are in Mubeh. So we are just getting some. We are getting some drinks here. Ah, see you. Hi, my people. Um, I arrived in Western Uganda safely, and please, guys, <laughs> I would have arrived way back, like uh, around, around um, five, five, five a.m. But I, I didn't make it because we had a flight uh, along the road. So it's, it's early in the morning. It's around um, eight. Okay. So that's when we arrived and I had to vlog this guys because I'm so happy this is my first time in Western Uganda So I'm so happy for that and I'm sharing you I want to share you each and everything in Western Uganda guys Yeah my first tourist destination and um, as I've told you guys I'm going to show you each and everything So watch me let me to you the homestead tour in Western Uganda. Watch out. Yeah. Hi, 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 my people. Welcome and welcome back to our YouTube channel, African Muwala. So, people, if you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe, uh, like, comment, and share my videos, African Muwala. And for those who have done it, please, I appreciate you guys. Thank you, thank you so, so much. Right about now, I'm in Kasese, one of the districts in, say, in Western Uganda. As I told you, I'm the to travel to Western Uganda. Those are the tracks. So this is a busy road, and I arrived here. That's why I live one of my friends' home. She hosted me here in Kasese. That's the home. And this is the road which led me to here. This road leads to, Ka to Congo, the other side, Congo, Demo Democratic Republic of Congo, one of the another African country. And this this one, the one which led us from uh, central Uganda, the one heading this side, but then the other side is Congo. So these cars are heading to Congo, another country, our neighboring country. without goats. The main landmark is goats. If you come here to Kasese, you have to eat go a goat. You have to they have to sort a year goat if you're a visitor. And also another 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 thing they do here mostly uh, is also cultivation. You can see this is a, a garden. From here it's a big garden. You can see it there.
that's a big garden. I told you that their landmark is God rearing, but also they do cultivation. And you can see one of this, this is one of the biggest gardens. And if I came here, guys, I saw every homestead has a garden like this. And that is maize. I will try you in another video around the gardens. That is maize. That is all Kaslese. This is all Kaslese. And Kaslese is one of the hilly districts we have here in Uganda. So that's the road I was telling you. The other road, the one which leads to Congo, our neighboring country. He's one of the guys who stays here in Kasese. He's been here for a long time. So I want him to tell you more about Kasese because I know he knows a lot about Kasese. So what's your name? Uh, I'm called Virianyama Erikan. He's Eli, he's called Eli. Okay, tell us more about Kase. So you can you can tell us in your native language. I will explain to them. Uh, So he's going to explain to you in, for those who, know, who don't know the native language. Bye! <laughs> he's going to explain to you in English. Okay? So what I've explained to you is that what you have in Kasese, the source of Iga mostly is, well, is coffee. Uh, the whole district, we are studying farm on Hilembe mines. Is also a source of income to the, uh, to the whole district. And what's the main source of income? Coffee. The, the main source of income is coffee. Okay. Yeah. However, I have vanilla, but the vanilla is here. Mm. Yeah. Bananas. Bananas, okay. Mostly, the, okay, the main source of income is coffee. Okay. Yeah. However, I have bananas, but it's not like... Like, like in central Uganda. Yeah. Here in Western Uganda, Kasese is the main source is coffee. Yeah. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. But you've explained a lot. You can you explain more? <laughs> you've yeah. talked a lot in your native language. <laughs> so I explain it in the photo or in, in, in my Okay, I I I I I I explained in 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 the photo let me also explain in, 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 in,
we have actually we, we, we received these visitors, we hosted the visitors, hmm. they were from Kampala. Actually they're happy when they're in Kampala. So you say in Kampala that is central Uganda. Yeah. When you hear about Kampala it is central Uganda and Tebe what and what. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we, he hosted we um just the neighbor here. Yeah. That's what he's saying that he we host, they hosted us. I came with my, one of my friends, so they hosted us. That's what he's saying. So there are very many things that have been and are happening again. Yeah, what I, uh, I, I I think she has explained to you Hello. what she has seen. She's happy with them. Other things are new to her. Yeah, they are new. They are very yeah, new to me. <laughs> they are very new. I'm just going to show them yeah. them in mind yes, as well. Mm. Also, it, is new. it is new to me. <laughs> Queen Elizabeth National Park. It's very new. I just saw it in a video in uh, on television, but I've never gone there, so it's also new to me. Yeah. And they have to wait for that those videos because I'm to upload them. Bye. So those are the Okay, bye. Thank you so much. May God bless you. Okay. Even kids dig here. So he's making he's weeding the garden. <laughs> he's weeding the garden. Hey, what's in Baby Kajo is planting sugar cane. Oh. Where are you? How are you? Fine, eh? So you're planting sugar cane. That's nice. You're good boys and girls. Bye. Yeah? <laughs> Thank you for working. The other one is a solar, that is a house, and they also have got this is another homestead. The goats are there, so this is another homestead, and also this is another homestead. The goats are here, that's why I've told you guys the landmark of Kasesa is goats rearing. It's a goat. If you're a visitor here, you have to, you have to, you slaughter the goats. Yeah, you can see the other good house there, also that's the way they. They roof their houses. The the roofing is different. The house it's a bit high. The roofing is a bit high. And as I want you to show you
and these are beans you can see up to there it's they're, they're doing it on a larger scale because it's in a village we call them here villages and there are hilly areas here like i told you kasasa is full of hills so the other one is a hill there are hills there even the other side far away you can see you can see them from far away this is also another my god you can see the goats also everywhere this is also another garden goats are everywhere here in Kasese. so that's These are, these are stones. Here they used to do their stone quarrying, and you can see this is another homestead also. But the goats are just right there, right there. I will see you. <laughs> This is also another homestead. You can see the other one is getting the goat to the. I think she's taking the goat to, to eat. I think for grazing. This is also another homestead. This is also another homestead here in Kasese. <sighs> that is also another homestead. This is one of the children he have formed. That is okay. Oh, see, she's <laughs> she's she wants to greet you in her language, and how that they greet like obusiye. 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 They say it's like saying how are you. Yeah. <laughs> Destinations here, yeah, there are a lot of destinations. I have Mount Renzori. You can, I think you've ever heard about that Mount Renzori, and here in that language, they call it Renzulu. And also, they have Nyamamba River. That Nyamamba River, it's of mysteries, it uh, floods once in a year. But when it floods, the residents, the citizens have to vacate that area those who are living near the area they have to vacate it and also we have so we have Kilembe mines as well where we get copper most of the copper that's gotten from Kilembe mines and there is even Lake Katwe but it's a bit far Lake Katwe and where they get salt well they they extract salt and also we have Queen Elizabeth National Park that's the best worst destinations out. I wanted to visit, but it's a bit, it's a bit very far. Though I'm still around, I might go there, but it's very far. It needs a lot. You can, it might, maybe you can use even a border. A border is, it takes you like a bit, maybe like five hours to finish a bit. So, yeah, those are the two worst destinations here. Yeah.